Oh dear me fellas, it has been a hot minute since we last opened a couple of Pokemon blind boxes. I can't even remember, I think it must have literally been in the old house, like maybe, I don't know, six months ago? Probably more than that, probably like eight months ago. I haven't opened a Pokemon related like blind box in ages, it's been so long. But, I thought you know what, today's the day, today's like the time has come, we crack open these Pokemon Center exclusive 20th anniversary blind boxes, because bro, what the heck is going on here? I literally, I, I'm not kidding, I think these blind boxes right here are Pokemon standing next to a street sign with their shadow on it. Like, we got Charmander, there's Charmander's shadow and it's a street sign. And I'm guessing you either get, oh look at this, at the top you get like Gengar and Psyduck as well. Dude, I don't even know what's going on there. Then we've also got our favourite like sort of chibi related Pokemon, these are the third generation of the blind boxes. I have opened number one and two on the channel, I can't remember when. Give it a give it a little search in the channel blind box, see what comes up. Yeah, I don't, maybe some cringy videos might come up. Don't do that. Don't search it. Um, and then we've also got these nano block blind bags, dude. I'm so excited. Like a flipping nano block Pokemon related blind bag. You cannot find these anywhere but Japan Pokemon Center. Um, and probably the internet after a while. But without further ado, I thought you know what? Let's crack these open. Let's see what's inside. And I think to start with, what do you reckon? You know what, let's start with, uh, we'll do one of these ones first. I'm so curious, like, whose idea was it? Let's do a, like, blind box, but have the, uh, the street sign as the, uh, sort of thing. Oh, dude, here we go, here we go, alright. Pikachu, Bulbasaur, a, uh, Charmander, Squirtle as well. Squirtle looks pretty weird. On the other side, we've got the Eevee, the Gengar, the Psyduck, and the Meowth. Which one do you want? Leave a comment in the comment section below. <laughs> I don't even know which one I'd want. Um, Gengar might be cool, I think Pikachu would probably be the absolute ripper of the set, wouldn't he? Um, and then I think I think it's all like, yeah, I think we just crack it open on the top and hope for the best. And hopefully, guys, I've got two of each one, we don't double up, because that would absolutely suck. But the very first one is literally, oh, it's Pikachu, it's a Pikachu, boys! What the heck? This is literally just a figurine. That's not even bad, though, I'm not, I'm not mad, doll. Pikachu one is actually pretty cool. Then you also get a bit of candy. I know guys, mum said never accept candy from strangers, but the Pokemon container can't be that bad, can it? Guys, guys, it's bubble gum. It's flipping, oh gosh, I'm just gonna, give me a second. <laughs> Dear me, that was uh, that was some minty fresh bubble gum. Oh, don't need to brush teeth this morning. And then uh, we've also got this little brochure right here. Same sort of thing. So, I guess these are meant to sit on your desk with you. Maybe if you like desk powers. So, yeah, we got this right here. Let's get the scissors out. And let me try and build this bad boy. I don't know how well this is going to turn out, but it can't be too bad. Oh, look, literally. Put that on there. So, you got that right there. And then I'm pretty sure Pikachu just sort of stands behind. Oh my gosh, look how well that goes together. Dude, that's sick. <laughs> okay, don't. Pikachu, come on. It's not that exciting. So he sort of goes right and he hides right behind the uh, the pole there. No way. Dude, that's so epic. That's actually really sick. And that will live on my desk, like, 100%. All right, I'm, I'm pretty happy with that one. Put that to the side. Pikachu keeps dying on me. What could the... Okay, we're opening the next one. I don't care. What could the next one be? Just anything but a Pikachu I'd be okay with. Get this one. Um, oh, maybe a Gengar, that'd be pretty cool. Eevee looks pretty cute. Charm, Bulbasaur, dude, they all look really, really cool. Maybe we should, oh. You know what? If this video gets enough, like, people behind it. Oh, dude, we got a Bulbasaur. We got a Bulbasaur. Sick. This is really cool. Look how cute he looks. If this video gets another, like, uh, I don't know, bunch of likes behind it, I'll buy a booster box of this stuff. And, uh, yeah, we'll just keep opening them. There's something about, like, blind boxes that are a bit different to, um, to, like, Pokemon cards. Just something a bit refreshing, I don't know. Okay. And it also, it doesn't really matter, because with Pokemon cards, you're always looking for that ultra-rare sort of thing. But with blind boxes, I love every result. But I will still go for that ultra-rare sort of thing. How does this work out? Oh, look at that! No way, that's so cute! Dude, there's- Oh, this is too much for Uncle Ender right now! Oh, that's epic! So then we got the uh, the two on the side here. Let me try and show you guys. Look at that. Oh my, could you imagine having a whole row of those bad boys just all lined up like all the different ones? Because there must be, there's eight, right? Yeah, eight different ones. 
Dude, that is so epic, and that gets me so sad we didn't buy more. I should have got them all at the Pokemon Center next time. It's alright. We got more, it's okay. So the next one we got here are the Chibi versions. Now, I don't know what the rarity are, but these are the six at the top right here. Pre-Marina, uh, all that. The six are down the bottom here in the Chibi form. But I think there might be nine different ones because it says nine on the front here. I don't know, man. I don't Japanese too well. And I think you can also register this for the uh, Pokemon Sun and Moon game somehow. I don't know what relation that has with it, but let's crack this one open. See what we get. Looks like the very first one is... Oh, it's a Mudsdale, I think. Is it? Look at this. It's gold. Dude, is this some kind of rare one? Nah, I think they might. this might be its usual color. It's flipping gold. Look at this, guys. I think we're learning something new today uh, together. Like, okay, this one's... In can you see that? It's like airbrushed as gold. And it's... Uh, but yeah, it's not totally gold. It's sort of just, I don't know, brushed over. Pretty random. I'll take that, though. What the heck? Alright, and then it's got the orange tinges to it as well. Put that to the side. And I guess we'll find out if the next one is uh, weirdly gold or if, like, that's an ultra rare one. Put these blind bags to the side. And, uh, yeah, let's keep going. So, we got this bad boy. And I guess, the I guess pre-marina or, like, Marchant would be pretty cool. Go for one of those two. Rip the lid off Hulk style. And without further ado, it's none other. <gasps> We're, look, dude, look. We're pulling everything that I wanted to. And this one isn't a gold brushed. So, this one might be the regular rare version. What are the chances? I was like, you know what? My champ be sick. We go and pull it. Alright, get these bags open. In the English, like when you buy a blind box, it's always like in a black sort of, you can't see through the bag. This one, they don't even care. They're like, you know what? Just give it a see-through bag. What the heck? These are absolutely tiny though. Compared to these, uh, the, what is it? The ones with the road signs, these ones are tiny as. <laughs> He's pretty much at the nightclub, so uh, yeah, that's really, really cute. I don't know. Definitely not as big, but I think they were the same price, so that's pretty interesting. And guys, we did get a gold one, so it's all good in the hood. Man, Pokemon blind boxes. Really weird, but I'm into it. I'm totally into it. All right, put all the rubbish to the side, and let's open up the Nanoblock blind bags. Mystery Pokemon. Secret. That's what I'm interested in. So, okay, okay, look at this, look at this, look at this. All of these ones are the potential pulls, plus one secret rare. I wonder what the secret rare is. Dude, if we can pull that today, I would be hype city. Okay, what do you think we're going to pull? Great ball, a, uh, oh, what else do I want? Lapras, uh, I've got the Charizard, so I don't want that. Me too. Me too be alright, actually. Rattata, yeah, I don't know. We'll find out, we'll find out. Nothing overly jumps out. Really on that secret though. Here we go, here we go. Got the instructions. Put that... Is that it? Okay, that's it. It is none other than the... Oh, it's pink! It's pink! Oh, dude, I think we got the secret! I think we got the secret! Let's bust open this, uh... Oh, my God! No! Oh, dude, oh, that wasn't even planned. That wasn't even planned. That wasn't even planned. Yo, that's so good! It's the Mew! Holy mother duck! What the heck? No way! Oh, that's so awesome! We got the Mew, the secret rare! On the first one! Yeah, that's so tight. Alright, so uh, I'm gonna try and speed build this right now. Gosh, it's gonna take a hot minute, but let's get to it. It can't be too hard, can it? Famous last words. Uh, so yeah, pretty much this is this is the finished Mew or what they think the Nano Block Mew should look like. It's absolutely tiny. It honestly, looks like one of those cats that doesn't have any fur. I don't. Know. <laughs> it's such a strange looking dude, but it has got like a little see-through stand which you did build. And dude, it is so tiny. Like my fingers hurt from pushing in those like really small blocks. But all up, really cute looking thing. Really interested to see what the other ones look like. But dude, we built none other than the Secret Rare Mew, and that is nuts. Oh my gosh, so we put that one to the side right there. Looks really, really cool. But what do you reckon? Can we go for two for two? Could you imagine if we pulled another Mew? On the back, looks like the same sort of ratios. We got the mystery one. Um, There's 12. How many is here? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. So yeah, that one definitely was the uh, mystery one. Let's go for a second one, see what we can get. And yeah, let's build another bad boy. These are pretty cool. I do like these a lot. So, the final one is none other. 
Then a Rattata. That's a Rattata for sure. It's purple. Yeah, that's none other. Look at that, dude. Rattata. All right, I'll time lapse this one, build this one, and then I think we're just about done. Oh, Phil, are you telling me I haven't grown a beard yet? Because it's literally been about 20 years, but I finally did it. I built the uh, Rattata right there. What do you guys think? Leave a comment in the comment section below. Which one do you like more? I must admit this one's going to be more like, I don't know. It looks a lot more like the Pokemon. It looks really, like, sort of scary. And then Mewtwo looks, I mean, uh, Mew here looks a bit weird. What do, you, what do you reckon? This one looks cool. He looks a bit bigger as well. Leave a comment in the comment section below. Which one is your favorite? I'm probably going with Rattata, but that is so sick that we managed to pull the Mew. And, uh, yeah. Dude, nano blocks are like something else. They're so difficult to build, but when you get like the finished product, it's so cute because there's no other like Lego that can build this small. What a what a random sort of video. Anyway, guys, I'm gonna sort of uh, let me just sort of fix all these up here, and then look at that. That's the entire of today's polls. What'd you guys think? Leave a comment in the comment section below. What'd you think of these Pokemon blind boxes? And if you really did like it, I can do another video. Um, I think Pokemon have released a whole new range of different ones. So, uh, yeah, if you want to see more blind box openings, let me know. I, I know, I have so much fun with these. They're a good break from the usual stuff. Because I don't even know what's happening with these things, but I always enjoy it. Kind of like Kinder Eggs. But, uh, yeah, leave me a in the comment section below. Have an absolutely fantastic day, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. But most of all, going to keep on gaming. All right, guys, till the next time, or I don't know, yeah. Till the next time we open another bunch of boxes and build that Nano Lego. And I'll put Band-Aids on all my fingers because they hurt now, but I'll see you then. All right, guys, let's keep on gaming. <laughs>